Egg volcano. Yeah, I ain't gonna put the bell pepper on there. Here y'all go. Look. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. So I'm just gonna dip the corn. Y'all know I don't even I'm even making sense right now. Whatever. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We're gonna eat a little, prank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you L O L when you click play? No, this ain't no clickbait. What's up, y'all? It's Tasha. I'm back with another solo video. Before I get into the video, I want to ask you guys to please thumbs this video. If you like it, share, comment, and subscribe. If you're new here, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If you've been here before, welcome back. I'm hungry, so let's get into the video. All right, now Stephanie did this for presentation. I'm taking this out because I do not want, I don't want a king crab, you guys. I, I don't, I don't know. I done had a little taste of snow lobster again. Snow lobster? Snow crab. And I'm cool on the, uh, that. And y'all, look at this. Okay, I ordered this online. Look at my potatoes. They look a lot bigger online. So I can't do the volcano, potato, or nothing. And it's about to be messy. Mm, that's good, but who needs that? You guys, I put two whole lemons in my juice, in my sauce. I'm gonna start with a shrimp. Oh, they look fat. Start with a shrimp. You know what? Let me scoot this over just a little bit so y'all can see me. You guys, this is going to be kind of ASMR-ish. Probably not. I'm just saying that. But, yeah. Anyway. Mm. Ooh, that is lemony. That's what I'm talking about. Really hungry, you guys. Haven't eaten all day, as usual. This will be my only meal. Mmm. Mm. 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 Rest in peace to that bell pepper. I did have a um a juice today. We had um apple, ginger, carrot, turmeric. If you like ASMR ish or just no talking, you're good for a few minutes. If you're new here, I have a wife that's not in this video. Stephanie, she just did her solo. I guess we do solos like once a week now because it's easier for us, you guys. If you don't know, we we do taxes, so we're busy. That's why we're not in the comments as much and all that, y'all know. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. This is like, I don't know, I feel like it's the best thing I ever tasted in my life. And yeah, I usually, I don't think I smack a lot. But when I'm hungry, I do. Somebody complained about my smacking the other day. I don't care, but... I feel like I'm smacking every video, so if you don't like smacking in that particular video, go to another one. Probably won't be no smacking in it. Jesus. All right, y'all. I can't really make a potato volcano, but I can try to make like a shrimp volcano. Okay. Y'all know I have to do it for you. Don't play. Don't play with me. They tried to play me with these potatoes, but... So I'm just gonna dip the corn. Y'all know I don't even I'm not even making sense right now. Whatever. 
Mm-mm. That is the best thing I ever had. Boom. Egg volcano. Let me get some onions and just sodium on there. Oh, mm -mm. you playing with me, but it's all good. There we go with a bell pepper. Yeah, I ain't gonna put the bell pepper on there. Here y'all go. Look, okay. Mm mm mm. Mm. Mm mm. So usually, I talk a little bit more, but I'm really, really hungry, and some of y'all like when I don't talk, so. Not me personally, but some of y'all like it being quiet, or just like to watch the eating, so I had to get y'all a little bit of something. But today's topic, mm, mm. It's from a viewer and it's about her hmm. it's about her son and his relationship with his father and what she should do about it I personally don't have a oh, I kind of do have experience with this sort of not so much I mean y'all have to see my pregnancy story to understand but I guess I kind of do but kind of don't Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This, this is good. I just don't see like seeing like little brown stuff on my crab because I can't. This potato is playing with me, but I'm gonna play right back. Mm. Mm mm mm. Mm. All right, let me try to get this big little snow crab there. Mm -hmm. Make sure ain't no gook in there. Probably went into the sauce, so whatever. Y'all can't even see my face. I think Stephanie gonna do a lot of clipping. Mm. Let's get this leg out because I know you're in there. I know you're in there. Come on. For real? Okay. I'm gonna have to tell y'all a story without reading it because my hands are a mess and I don't want them all over my phone. So, basically, this woman was in a relationship with this guy. She got pregnant. Mm. Found out that her kid. I was autistic. At seven months old, dad decides he doesn't want to be in the baby's life. He doesn't have anything to do with the baby. Doesn't claim the baby. He's in another relationship, gets another woman pregnant. He's married. Has children. And still ha wants to have nothing to do with his son. But he had with her. She's reached out to him over and over again, and he keeps telling her that he wants nothing to do with her baby, and she keeps pursuing him. Her question was, should she stop pursuing him? My short answer is, absolutely. Mm -mm 
Now, she wants to be fair to her son and give him an opportunity to have a father. So she doesn't want, she like doesn't want to stop contacting him because of that. But I feel like you've done all you can. There's nothing you can do about what he doesn't want. If his father doesn't want anything to do with him, you can't make him. He obviously has a problem with your son's developmental issue and is not man enough to deal with it. He doesn't have a problem with kids because if he did, he wouldn't be dealing with the kids he's with. Or he might. I mean, if they break up, he might leave them kids too. But if it's all based on the fact that your son has autism, he's just not a strong man. He's weak. And he chooses to run away from hardship or what some people would consider. I don't want to say it's a hardship, but it's not, it's not easy. It's, it's a change. It's something that you have to get used to. And there's things you have to learn, but that's just like with being a parent of any baby, you got to learn that person, that, that human, excuse me. So forget him. He's not good for your baby. I feel like I don't want to have nothing to do with him. Your children's siblings? I mean, that's sad, but to be honest, the father is not teaching his kids to have a bond with your child. They probably won't. Especially at a young age. Maybe when they get older, but that I'll say, move on. Find somebody that you vibe with and hopefully they will help you with your son. The right person will. If somebody loves you, they're going to love your child, period. So I say move on. You're only hurting yourself. Um, now. I have like two Q&A questions. I'm going to go ahead and get to I'm sorry if y'all hate the way I ate. Like I had a hard time with everything. I had such a hard time. I couldn't even eat. Like I'm even upset. I mean I got some more crab here. Let me try this. I'm upset at how I ate. I really am. But it is what it is. Mmm. Somebody asked this. I thought it was cute. And thank you. She says, her name is Tangler Humphrey. Why are you guys such outgoing, caring people person? People, people, I guess. Um, the answer to that is me personally, I can only ask for myself. I wasn't always outgoing like I am now. Um, when I started to become more outgoing, I became happier. Um, being caring and being a people person makes you happy. That's how I feel. I used to be very, um, I won't say closed off, but I just didn't talk. I was quiet and I was the one sat in the background, which I am still the one that sits in the background, but only for a little while until I see everybody, check everybody out. And then I'm out there. I like to talk to everybody. I like to have a good time. I like to talk to people I don't know, um, and get to know them. Like, like when we go to a club or something, I'm the one that I go out there and talk to people I don't know. And because it kind of seems like when I get out there, I see people that kind of stand offish, but when you talk to them, you open them up and they become like a different person automatically. So, or be, they become themselves. I think people are like shy or whatever. Anyway, I think when you are outgoing and a people person, you, you make your life what you want it, you know, happy. Um, another question. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. A lot of people are asking when did I come out. There was a few, several people that asked that. So if um, if you haven't heard um, before, hmm. that shit was good. I don't know. Oh, I didn't. I didn't come out. I was just out. There was no coming out. I was just out. I was like, hey. Anyway, so 
I think this was a horrible eating video. Um, very horrible, but it is what it is. If you love me, you stayed. If you hate me, you definitely didn't stay, cause this wasn't that great. But uh, if you wanna know more about us, our link is in the description below. Below, Steph and Tasha Vlogs. Um, hit that notification bell so you, oh no, Stephanie says, turn that post notification to all so you can be um, aware of when our next video live stream premiere comes out. Uh, shoot, I'm done. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie, I'm done, bye. Only good vibes.